Oh my god, no way. Look at this, guys. They have a South Park Mr. Hanky costume. I cannot believe it. Mr. Hanky the Christmas Poo. We love him and he loves you. Spirits open, let's go! Pick me up in an hour. All right, guys, I have filmed Spirit Halloween stores in every one of 50 states across the entire country of America, finishing off that tour last year with a bang in Alaska and Hawaii, and I have finally made it. I have finally made it here to Canada, to this Spirit Halloween. Where's a sign? Right there. There's actually three signs up there. What the heck? Yes, look at this. There are actually three signs on this building, one ginormous one on the top, and then they have two more small signs right below that one. Ah yes, the great sign debate. Why do some stores have ginormous signs and some stores have tiny signs? This store has both. Before we even go in here, I wanna tell you something. You know the very first thing that I noticed when I rolled into Canada? The speed limits. In America, we have like 25, 30, 35, 70, 75. I rolled in yesterday and the speed limit was 62. What in the world is up with that? All right, anyway guys, here we go. Lundy's Lane, Niagara Falls, Ontario, Canada, Spirit Halloween. I just wanna take a closer look at these smaller signs for a minute because these are a little bit different. These look to be like foam or something. They have a little bit of depth to them. And you know what? This is a very long storefront here. So let's take a look before we even go in. And look at this. I just noticed there's even more signs up. All right, in between all our awesome posters here, I can see that we have a gargoyle inflatable going on. We have the skeleton inside a broken coffin right here. He's actually breaking out of the coffin. And I think it's such a cool touch that they made the eye glow. We got the inflatable ghosty here on the end if we keep on moving here we have what do we have oh we have the inflatable small ghosty over here we have the inflatable small pumpkin stack over here do we have any more doesn't look like we have any more but that is a super long entrance to the spirit halloween store and they have yet a fifth sign up here on this beam i don't think i've ever seen a spirit halloween with five signs before all right let's go ahead in guys and see what's up with the Spirit Halloween in Canada. My very first Spirit Halloween store in Canada. Man, I don't know what this store used to be, but I am already loving the design I see in these windows. And check this out, look at these wooden ceilings. I know that's not what we're here to see, but it's very mesmerizing and entertaining to me. <laughs> All right, as we enter the door, guys, the very first thing we see is the Wheel of Fate, so I have to spin it right here. The very first Wheel of Fate being spun in a Canada store, a Canadian store. I don't know the Canadoos and Canadons around here, so I might get in trouble for making some jokes. Will I live? Will I die? What's happening here? Quit clowning around and try again. I do love that as I first enter in, I am immediately greeted by the Hello Rat. Whoa, look at this guys. Already I am seeing things I've never seen in the store before. It is a ghost face bath mat. Stay scary. Oh Canada, you're already winning my heart. No. Look at this, guys. They even have a ghost face shower curtain here. Excuse me, sir. I'm trying to talk to the folks in Canada. I can't even talk. All right, let's give this guy a little bit of attention here. Art the Clown. And he is on the sensor, so he just keeps going and going. And then we got this guy beside him going absolutely crazy. Nibbles the clown. I hear you, sir. So come a little closer and try to take some. What do you say? Look at this, we got two grave watchers down here at the bottom in between them. We have the zombie Steven Seagull down here. All right, let's go on over to the side here. We got the carnival sign set up here. We have this, is this the sitting scary scarecrow, I think? Let's give him some stickers and find out. Yes, it is. 
All right, sir, share those stickers, please. One thing I don't think I've pointed out laying around here are the awesome popcorn box props. That looks so cool. Those are more than likely for sale at the end of the season along with the rest of the ISE setups. And then we got Mac Straw waiting over here for us. Let's get him going. Come on, Mackie. <laughs> He's laughing at us, but it appears that he's in suspended animation with his friend Nibbles over there. Let's look at some of the plushies up here real quick before we move on. We have a ghost face here. And then of course we have our favorite Crouchy. We have Sam down here with his lollipop. And the Harvester over here, I love this guy. I'm pretty sure I bought him a year, about a year ago maybe. All right, let's look at the shirts quick before we move on too, because a lot of people have been looking for this Art the Clown shirt right here. And apparently they're having a hard time finding them. But as I look down here, check this out. Canada has got it going on. They have got an entire stack of these things. Everything from double X to extra large, large, medium, and small. So if you're looking for one, grab your passport, cross the border, drive 31 miles an hour, and you can come get one. All right, before we move on, let's leave some stickers right here at the Wheel of Fate. All right, guys, I am so excited to start looking around through these aisles here, but I want to come over here first because everybody seems to want me to do the animatronics first. So we're going to check out what they got for sale on the floor. We've got a fogging skull pile on the top. We've got a ringmaster here in the store. We've got a scary sitting scarecrow on the bottom and a sinister spirit doll on this side. A plethora of jumping spiders. We got the brown. We got the black and red. Do we have a black? Do we have a black? I don't see a black. There may be more this way though we do have a towering Tallulah here oh my gosh look this store is so much bigger than I thought and there's all kinds of animatronics and some stuff on the floor I can't even talk I'm so excited I can't talk we got a gravestone ghoul here we have a dark princess they actually have a dark princess here I think this is only the third store I've been to where they actually had a dark princess in stock look at this oh my gosh they actually have two keepers here right now one, two. Sandwiched right between two sitting scarecrows. One of them's scary. They have three Wanda Webworths right here. What Webworth? Did I just say Wanda Webworths? We have one, two, three demonic gatekeepers here. Oh my gosh, no they don't. This is absolutely insane. They actually have an entire section for this. Disgusting! All right, let's continue. All right, back on track. We got a sitting scarecrow here. We got a Mac straw. His box is much smaller than I expected it to be. We got a towering Tallulah over here. We got some inflatables over here. We got the inflatable purple haired spinning eyes clown. We got three jack o' lantern archways. We got a fogging skull pile here. We got another sitting scarecrow and another scary sitting scarecrow. And look what they actually have in stock. Wow, guys, check this out. This is the first time I'm seeing this in a store. The Art Krispies Bloody Rice Cereal with Marshmallows Tumbler. That is another thing that a lot of people are looking for and cannot find. Wow, so far Canada does not disappoint. And they actually have two of them in stock. Look at this. Here's another one that I haven't seen. Deadpool, you're welcome. All right, you know what? Let's just keep on moving through the store here, see if there's any more animatronics. Here's another stack of the jumping spiders. And here we have a black one. And right below that, we have the gray. So they have all four different colors of the jumping spiders here. Oh my gosh, behind me, they have even more jumping spiders. Let's just take a quick walk down through here, looking for more animatronics, because sometimes these stores like to put them like back in the corners kind of hidden okay none in there let's keep making a circle around here let's go on up through this way here i do see there's a whole bunch of inflatables over here oh here you go that's what i was talking about tucked away in a corner right here ghost face this is not the animatronic this is the one that just lights up in the face and the knife still very cool and look at this it is actually friday the 13th when i am filming this guys and we have the friday the 13th jason solar 
bobblehead. That is cool. And look at all of them bobbling. That's hilarious. Check out these guys up here. See, this is the cool thing with the solar ones. It's the solar that makes them bobble. Look at Freddy right there. He is totally awesome. And then we have Beetlejuice here. And then we have Pennywise down here on the bottom bobbling away. That's funny. When I did my video of all Friday the 13th, I did not see this bobblehead in the store. But if you guys haven't watched that one, make sure you go back and watch it because there's a lot of stuff that I got distracted by and saw in that store that I hadn't seen before. Check this out. It is a pink ghost face. Handmade by robots, pink ghost face keychain. Whoa, look at this. I've never seen this in a store before. It is a ghost face trick-or-treat bucket. Speaking of buckets, let's leave some stickers in the bucket, the bucket, the bucket, the bucket, and one in the ghost face bucket. All right, let's move around this way, guys, see if there are any other animatronics hiding around the corners here. And I am not seeing any, so let's go ahead and just walk around the store, see if there's any other stuff I haven't seen in other stores. I gotta say, this store is very well organized, guys. Guys, this is one of the best organized stores I've ever been in. This guy knows because he can see it with four eyes. I don't know if I've ever seen that mask before. Oh, here's this Don Post mask here that reminds me of the Scooby-Doo movie. Old Man Smithers, they have the grandma masks. Can you please take out the trash, honey? Yes, grandma, thank you for making me a grilled cheese. This right here is the look on my face every time I get a really stupid comment on my videos. <laughs> Look at this, guys. The Canadian stores have the pig friend. And the chicken friend. Oh, look. This is the first store I've seen the perma blood in. They have green and they have red. I wonder if they have any of those IR sensors. I see they do have the multi-prop remote. Groundbreaking pumpkin, groundbreaking skeleton. We have two of the dual masked inflatables. Walking monster hand, walking zombie hand. And look at this. As soon as I touch them, they started walking. Yes, they have the hook eye guy and the hook head hog. They also have the clown head and the pumpkin guy wrapped up with a rope. We got monkey chimes, the butcher, and pestilence. Pete. Everything is on sensors in here, guys. As soon as I walk by these, they start it up. This little lady is enjoying her pumpkin here. And this guy is playing peekaboo. Mini peekaboo clown. Let's leave some stickers down here for Spider Biter Billy. We got the hand eater and the rat eater on the end here. We have a couple of ghost face horror babies. Oh, this is cool. I'm not sure if I've seen this before. The pumpkin peeper. You carve the top off the pumpkin and you stick him in there holding the top up. Oh, and look at that. He lights up too. That is very cool. Oh my gosh, I think my belt is giving out. It feels like my pants are falling down. We got a clearance section here too. And look what's in it. The giant inflatable heart from Looney Tunes. You know, thinking about this Art Krispies tumbler here, it makes me wonder if they have the crossbody bag. Wait a minute, I missed a couple of animatronics up here. They have two Bubbas here. Here's some slippers I don't think I've seen yet this season. Sonic slippers. These are like the big red boots. All right, let's take a walk real quick through this costume section here. See if there's any awesome costumes I haven't seen before. I do love a good bee costume. Look at this. We got the bee jumpsuit and we have the queen bee costume there. And let's not forget this guy, the bee stinger. We're not going to go into that. Oh my god. No way. Look at this, guys. They have a South Park Mr. Hanky costume. I cannot believe it. Mr. Hanky the Christmas Poo. That has got to be one of my favorite costumes I've ever seen. We love him and he loves you. Oh, here's Deadpool slippers. Have we seen these? If they had the art crossbody bag, it would more than likely be in this section right here. They have the glasses, the socks, and the double-sided Terrifier knife but no crossbody bag. They do have a bling Jack Skellington though. Oh, look at this. They also have the ghost face bling and the ghost face devil bling. Go back to Hexer. All right, one more section over here, guys. This is where we first came in and we saw the stay scary bath mat. They do have the killer clowns popcorn gun. Wait, have I seen this? The ghost face pumpkin carver statue. Oh, look at this. They do have the three pack of haunted mansion side steppers. I haven't seen these in many stores. Very cool. Is this guy going to sidestep? Maybe his batteries are dead. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, there you have it. My very first 
Spirit Halloween store in Canada and it did not disappoint. Very awesome. And I bought one of the Art the Clown tumblers.